Welcome to our free workout Friday. 35 minute kettle fit, full body flex. It's Friday, it's time to flex. Let's get into our warm up right here with our air squats. We got a six minute warm up for you here. Three, two, one, and Nikolai's so excited. He just started, he just started. I, I'm getting the feeling that you might be feeling that same way too. All right, just sinking into a nice low squat here. Hey, before I forget, don't forget to download the Pro Kettlebell Workouts app. Why wait? Don't wait. Go to your favorite app store and pick that baby off. You get plenty of great workouts, great techniques and tips. Three, two, one. Here comes the squat benders. So a squat, now we're touching the toes here, adding that as a variation today. So Pro Kettlebell Workouts app. All right, we got 10 more seconds here on our squat benders. Next up, we are gonna go into an alternating hip circle in three, two, one, alternating hip circle. So a little bit wider stance, come around to the front and then working around to the back. So working around left and right. You might notice that uh, Nikolai up here on the platform today has a pair of kettlebells. So if you have a pair of kettlebells, you, uh, never gonna hurt you to have an extra set a light set and a heavy set, ever, ever. Nobody's gonna call you names or anything if you have two sets of kettlebells. All right, we're getting ready for our standing folding star here. Three, two, one, here we go. Standing folding star, nice arms to the ceiling and then over to the toe, opposite toe. Good, warming up the back. The glutes, the calves, the hamstrings, upper back, shoulders, hitting it all here. Pro Kettlebell Workouts app. Download it. 10 more seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hip swings, hip swings. Nikolai's gonna start here with his left leg, post up on the right leg. Perfectly fine to bend the knee there to give you a little more stability. And work that hip, getting some open traction in that joint by Keeping that leg up in the air, swinging back and forth. Good job, we'll be doing this 30 seconds on the left and 30 seconds on the right. Three, two, one, and switch sides, please. There you go. Free workout Friday, we're excited to have you here. All right, in 15 seconds, we're gonna do We'll walk out push-ups for 30 seconds here. 10 more seconds here of hip swings. Let that leg swing freely, using the momentum. Three, two, one, and here's a walk out push-up. Walk the hands down to the deck, walk forward, support yourself, lower yourself into a push-up, come right back up, and walk yourself back to the start position. Standing tall, good. We'll get the hips and hamstrings. Get the shoulders warmed up, the chest muscles warmed up. We got 10 more seconds of walkout push-ups and we will transition seamlessly into your scapular push-ups in three, two, one, and scapular push-ups. So here's a push-up where you keep your arms straight and the shoulder blades go down, down, chest goes to the floor and then shoulder blades go up to the ceiling. So we're looking to activate those muscles in the upper back push the shoulder blades apart, push them towards the ceiling, lower the sternum toward the floor. 10 more seconds here, creating space in that shoulder girdle. Four, three, two, one, and flat to the deck for scorpion, alternating scorpion. So right foot across your body and left foot across your body, alternating back and forth. This is a good opener for the low back and the shoulders. Excellent, we got about 10 more seconds to go and lizard lunges will be next. Lizard lunges will be next in three, two, one, and come on up into a lunge position. So push up position, bring that left foot forward and then shoot that leg back and then right leg forward. This gives you a chance to open up those hips 
20 more seconds of alternating lizard lunges. Good job up there. In 10 seconds, stand tall and high knees in five, four, three, two, one. Stand tall, high knees, please. There you go. Stay light on your feet. If you like, you can give yourself a target like Nikolai's doing. The hands are out. Try to hit the tops of your legs right on your hands. And you can raise or lower your hands depending on how you're feeling about your expectations today. All right? Totally customizable warm up for you. All right, how about some butt kicks here? All right, good. Now those hamstrings are working more actively. You can place your hands back behind your body there and aim to strike your palms with the heels of your feet. All right, 10 more seconds here to go, about 10 more seconds to go, and we'll jump into our free workout Friday, 35 minute kettle fit, full body flex, four, three, two, one, and that concludes our warm up. How are we feeling up there today? We're feeling good? All right, let's get a little sip of water here before we head into our first exercise. So it's four moves here, four moves. We've got a swing, clean, a rack squat and snatch. We'll perform these for one minute each. So 30 seconds on the left of a swing, then 30 seconds on the right for a swing. The next move is a clean. So you'll transfer over to the left side and clean on the left for 30 seconds. I'll count you out on all this and then we're gonna clean on the right hand side. Rack squat is next, so back to the left side clean to the rack, drop into a squat, come right back up. And then the last move here, and then we're gonna go into snatch. And then we're gonna do them all together as a swing and a clean and a rack squat and a snatch. There it is. All right, how are we feeling up there? We're feeling ready to go. We're ready to go at home. Three, two, one, and begin. Good, 30 seconds on the left. Breathe out as the bell goes down and let the breath drop in as the bell comes up. All right, 10 more seconds here on the left. Four, three, two, one, and right side. There you go. Using the hand without the bell will help you utilize your torso muscles to get that bell up in the air. Good job. So the arm swings almost in sync with the hand with the kettlebell. All right, we're getting ready for our cleans here. Gonna switch to the left. Three, two, one, and do some cleans here on the left-hand side. 30 seconds of cleans. Catch the bell in the rack position. Keeping the elbow close to the hip so we can load the weight over the hips and over the legs for support. Get a little mini rest in there. Getting ready to switch here to the right side. Three, two, one, and switch to the right. Breathing is the same on the clean as it is on the swing. That bell goes down, the breath goes out. As the bell comes up, the breath goes in. Take a little pause there in the rack position if you need to. All right, we're getting ready for our rack squat here. In three, two, one, switch to the left and rack squat. There it is. Rack and squat. That bell is in the rack and squatting. Good job. Keep the breath moving during this movement. Press those feet through the floor from your heels to your toes. Good job. Find that position that's comfortable for you in the squat. And let's switch sides here, please. Two, one, and rack squat right. Looking good. Sink down 
and pull yourself into that squat. There you go. Good job. Ten seconds to go. Snatch is next on the left hand side. Three, two, one, and let's snatch on the left. 30 seconds left, 30 seconds right. Let that bell fall through the legs. Great job. Push that hand through the window to catch the bell in the top position there. Three, two, one. Switch to the right side, please. There you go. Nice job. Keep it up. We have about 10 seconds to go, then we're gonna put all four of these moves together in one move. Getting ready for a swing here. Three, two, one, here we go. One swing, one clean, a rack squat, and snatch. And one snatch, there you go. One minute per side. One swing, one clean, a rack squat, and snatch. Good job. All right, 30 seconds to go here on the left. We're in the complex part of this exercise of this set. One swing, clean, rack squat, and snatch. Four, three, two, one, and switch. One swing, one clean, rack squat, and snatch. Great job. Thirty seconds to go. Looking good, coming up on the twenty second mark here. Final fifteen. One swing, one clean, rack squat and a snatch. We got time for one more complex in here. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. Good job. Nice finish there at the top. High five. Way to go. Good job up there, Nikolai. All right, moving on to section number two. This is a 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off of work. Kneeling halos, sit-up twist, and Spider-Man push-ups, Spider-Man push-ups. So grab a mat or grab something soft for your knees, find a kneeling position and choose an appropriate weight for you to move around your head. This is what halos are. So alternating position around to the left and up and around to the right. So it starts right at your face and then works your way around. Our second exercise is a sit-up twist. So with the kettlebell, you can get that mat out there. Grab a kettlebell by the horns and up into your sit-up and then twist left and right and back down and your next time up you'll go right and left. So that's our sit-up twist and our final exercise in this panel is a Spider-Man push-up. So round to a plank position, drop into that push-up and bring the knee toward the elbow. So as you go down, right elbow, left elbow. All right. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds transition time into the next exercise. Here we go. Kneeling halos. Five, four, three, two, one, and begin. Good job. Left and right. Eight, seven, six, five, 
four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job. Sit up twist. Five, four, three, two, one, begin. Sit up and twist. There you go, right and left. Back down and up, left and right. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and time. Spider-Man push-ups to finish this. First round of four rounds. Five, four, three, two, one, begin. Sink down, drive the knee to the elbow. There you go. Keep that trunk parallel to the floor as you sink down. Really working core stability here and our upper body strength, lower body stability. Three, two, one, and time. Great job. First round complete. Round two, kneeling halos. Bell in front of your face. Three, two, one, let's go. There you go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. 10 seconds of rest. Sit up twist is next. We are in round two, round two of four. Three, two, one, begin. Twist to the right and then the left. Good job. Come on up and then left to right. There you go, that's it. And right to left. Great job. And left to right. Two, one, and rest. Good job. Spider-Man push-up. Four, three, two, one, begin. There you go. Good job. Nice and strong. Keep those core muscles engaged. Six, five, four, three, two, one and rest all right nice job we are halfway done with this panel here panel number two kneeling halos third time around three two one let's go working those shoulders all the muscles that help improve and maintain our posture excellent seven six Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Sit up twist. Third time through. Six, five, four, three, two, one, here we go. That's it, right and left. And here we go, up, left and right. Keep it up. Keep breathing, keep breathing through this movements. Three, two, one, and rest. Spider-Man push-up. Finishing up round three. Take a breath. Set yourself. Three, two, one, begin. There you go. Right into it. No hesitation. Great job. Hang in there. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. All right. Take a quick second here to catch your breath. Kneeling halos. Last round here. Fourth round here. Make it count. Two, one, begin. Kneeling halos. 
There you go. Excellent. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Time. All right, sit up twist. Last time through with the sit up twist. Four, three, two, one. Let's go. There you go. Right and left. Come on up and left and right. Great job. Extra credit for keeping those feet off the ground. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Great job, Spider-Man push-up. Finish strong here, finish this set strong. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, down you go. There you go. That's it, way to push yourself. Push yourself, that's where the gains are. Keep that torso under control. Keep those hips facing the ground. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and done. Fantastic, great work up there on the platform. Way to go, nice job at home. That's a challenging one, that was a challenging panel there. Way to go, nice work. All right, panel number three. We have four exercises, 30 seconds on, 10 seconds of rest, times two. Our first exercise is a sumo deadlift. So bring that kettlebell right down the center of your body, handles across the laces, wide stance, pull the bell off the floor. Sumo deadlift, squeeze those cheeks at the very top of the movement, keep the elbows straight as you pull up off the floor. The second exercise is a squat press, squat press. So you take the kettlebell into your squat and press the bell from that bottom position. We'll do 30 seconds on the left and then 30 seconds on the right. So that's the squat press. The last exercise in this complex is a V-up or a supine folding star. So the V-up, you're uh, lying flat on your back, fingers are gonna come up toward the toes and reaching for the top of your laces. And the folding star would be right arm, left ankle, left arm, right ankle. All right. Thank you, Nikolai. Let's get ready for panel number three. This is 30 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, two rounds, sumo deadlift. Ready on the platform? Let's begin. Three, two, one, let's go. All right, straight up. So if you have a pair of dumbbells, you wanna make sure both of those pairs are working. Two pairs of kettlebells. So make sure both of those are working. If you got one, you can pull that off the floor too. Make sure we're picking something heavy off the floor, all right? This is a significant strength builder, lean muscle mass builder. Keep it up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Great job. All right, here we come with the squat press on the left side first for 30 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and here we go. Great job. Looking for that nice, tall press to the ceiling, creating space between your shoulders there. So press into the floor, press up toward the ceiling. Great job. Looking good, we got about 10 seconds to go here on the left. We'll have a 10 second transition to get into the right in five, four, three, two, one. All right, transition that bell to your right side. You got 10 seconds to do this, so take your time. Make sure you have a good grasp on the kettlebell, a good insertion. And here we go, squat press, three, two, one, begin on the right. Straight up, great job. Keeping your eyes on the bell helps to keep that arm straight and in alignment with your shoulder. Great job. 10 seconds left. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And put that kettlebell down. Let's get ready for V-ups. 
or supine folding star. You're gonna pick your version. What's your best challenge today? Three, two, one, begin. Good, reach high. Twenty seconds to go. That's it. Keep it up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. All right, great job. Back to sumo deadlift. One bell or two, whatever is appropriate for you, whatever equipment you have today. Let's pull something heavy off the floor. Two, one, begin. Good. Nice wide stance. Nice straight arms. Bring those hips through. Pull the weight off the ground. 15 seconds to go. Excellent. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. All right, squat press is next. We'll start on the left side. Ready? Four, three, two, one, go. Nice work. Keep the breath moving during the exercise. Ten seconds to go. Nice and tall. There you go. Good. Extend to the ceiling. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Transition. Ten seconds. Catch your breath here for a second. Transitioning to the right. Good insertion. Rack position in the squat. Two, one, begin. Press up to the ceiling. There you go. Fifteen seconds to go. Almost there. Looking good. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fantastic. Way to go. All right. Let's finish strong here with the V-up or the supine folding star. Five, four, three, two, one. Begin. Good. The difference between these two is we're moving one leg at a time as opposed to both legs. This is a great variation to use, especially if you're in your second set or feeling a little exhausted here. This will help you maintain your form and build strength safely. Ten seconds to go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. Great job. High five up here. Great job there. Grab a quick sip of water, towel off if you need to. And we're getting ready for our last set here, our fourth panel today. This is a four minute AMRAP, so you're going to be spending four minutes of work there, getting as many repetitions as you can. Our first exercise here, this will be in sets of five is the kettlebell or bodyweight burpee. So we're looking for five burpees here. So if you're using kettlebells, they're gonna go up from a deadlift down to the floor, shoot the leg back, down into your push-up, and come on up into a deadlift. There's one. So the bodyweight version, hands are gonna go down to the deck, shoot the legs back into a thruster, push up, pop back up, and stand tall, and a little jump shot for extra credit. Our second exercise are gunslingers. You can do this with one bell or two. If you've got two bells, you can get the job done more efficiently, right? So there's one. This is like an outside clean without cleaning the bell. Just like that. Excellent. And the one hand version, you'll just do one hand five and the other hand five. So there's five on that side. And then you'll switch after that five and do a second five. Our last exercise in this AMRAP is a squat jack. 
and this is five touches on each hand. So there's one, one, and two, and two. So right hand, left hand, right hand, left hand, times five. Four minutes of work here, Nikolai. Are we ready on the platform? Oh yeah. Kettlebell or bodyweight burpee times five, four, three, two, one, begin. AMRAP stands for as many reps as possible, as many rounds as possible. We've already defined what the reps are, so we're trying to get as many rounds in as we can. Nikolai's demonstrating the kettlebell burpee. You can do a bodyweight burpee too, perfectly fine. Get those five knocked out. When you're done with those five burpees, it's on to Gunslinger. Great job. All right, use that good swing form here. There you go. Excellent, let's get ready for squat jacks here. Gonna get a touch for each one of those hands. There's one, and one, and two, and two. Keep it up. That's it. Pop back up. Great job. All right, right back to that burpee, kettlebell burpee or bodyweight burpee. Both are highly effective exercises for developing strength, cardiorespiratory fitness, and endurance. Physical endurance, muscular endurance, and mental endurance. Good. Keep it up. Keep moving forward. That's it. Keep moving forward. Great job. Coming up on the halfway point here. Gunslingers are after those burpees. That's it. All right. We are just past the halfway point here. Round in second, headed for third. Squat jacks. Keep it up. We're going to keep that breath moving. There you go. Keep that breath moving. That's it. 100 seconds to go. Good, keep the breath moving. That's it. Great job, keep it up. Keep it up at home, keep it up, hang in there. We got 70 seconds to go. Nice job. Excellent, gunslingers are next after those burpees. Beautiful. All right. Nice work. 45 seconds. Final 30 seconds. Keep getting those rounds in. Keep getting those rounds in. Stay light on your feet. Pop up, pop down, pop up, pop down. 20 seconds to go. It's all yours to use. It's all yours to use. Let's go. All for you. 15 seconds to go. Keep it up. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. How about a double high five there? Woo, way to go. What a fantastic free workout Friday. Great work up on the platform. Great work at home. Way to stick with it. This is a challenging workout. Let's get into our stretch here. So move the kettlebells out of the way. Reach to the ceiling. Nice wide stance. And then reach your fingers towards your toes. You're going to keep your eyes open to maintain your balance. Targeting a stretch on the low back and the hamstrings. You got 10 more seconds to go here. 
Next, we'll get on the floor, two, one, and a little bit of thread the needle here. So cross the right ankle over the left knee, and bring your hands, thread your hands through the needle there. If you can, get them to the front of the knee and pull towards your chest. You get a nice stretch on the outside of the right hip there, and a little bit of stretch there in the low back as well. 10 more seconds here on this side, and we'll transition over to the left in seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and switch sides. So cross the left ankle over the right knee, reach through your legs and grab the top of the knee. 10 more seconds here. Three, two, one, and let's transition into a hip flexor stretch. So you're gonna take a knee, tall position here right knee down left knee up and if you like you can raise that trailing arm up into the air and willow over to the side and get a nice stretch along your sides there five four three two one and other side please nice and tall Tall torso, push the glute forward, and a willow over to the right. Four, three, two, one, and flat to the ground here for scorpion. Extend the left arm out to the side, bring the right leg up and over toward your left hand. Targeting the stretch on the shoulder shoulder that's in the ground or opening up those chest muscles also working on the low back stretching the connective tissue in the low back four three two one and other side please left leg over Three, two, one, and back to neutral. Press up into Cobra. Press the hips into the ground. Reach the center of your chest across the room. Be mindful of your low back. We don't want to put excess pressure on the low back. So find your sweet spot there. Four, three, two, one, and push back into child's pose, please. So bum to heels, outstretch your arms across the room. If you like, you can move your arms over to the right. Give yourself a little bit of an extra stretch on the left side of your back, on your lats. 10 more seconds here. Six, five, four, three, two, one and done. Thank you very much for joining us on Free Workout Friday. Great job up there on the platform. That's our pro kettlebell, kettle fit, full body flex. We'll see you next time. Have a great day.